Now, this is an interesting one right here. I mean, there have been plenty of interesting ones all across the league, but the Jacksonville Jaguars, after signing the linebacker yesterday, I'm not going to try to say his name because I do not want to butcher it. So y'all know who I'm talking about, though. And Jaguars, they signed a the linebacker. They've been, they signed Christian Kirk. Um, they just signed uh, another wide receiver, too. But they, they've been going crazy in free agency, spending a lot of money. They've been trying to set their own market. Uh, we'll see if the NFL follows the Jaguars market or the previous NFL market. But anyway, um, when you spend a lot of money, a whole lot of money, uh, a lot of times you've got to make some tough decisions. And that's not just in NFL. That's in life in general. But the Jaguars, they had to let go. Well, they didn't have to, but they chose to let go uh, their leading tackler from last year, Mr. Miles Jack. And Miles Jack, man, um, he is he's a good player he, he can't get picked up I, I remember initially he had like injury concerns coming out of college and whatnot uh, but he sort of put those to rest for the most part and he's been an exceptional linebacker great open field tackler uh, a, a speedy linebacker so he got some good uh, open field tackling got some good range to him too um and he he's gonna make a team uh, that much better with his services uh, oftentimes when i think about miles jack um i just get reminded of a couple years well a little more than a couple years ago that jaguars team mm, that you just knew they were going to the super bowl you just knew it you just knew it um and they should have but the nfl was like ah no we got other plans but miles jack he can be a playmaker um, he, he can make some noise and I just like, you, you gotta feel like today is March 15th. It's March 15th right now. I feel like for Miles Jack, um, maybe by the 18th at the latest, then I think he will have had his new home. Uh, he joins Bobby Wagner, um, as some of the better linebackers that are out there. Now, Bobby Wagner, of course, is a bit older. Um, he's 31, but Miles Jack is uh, 26. 26 years old, man. I, I did not realize that Miles Jack was still that young. That That's crazy. Um, but, yeah, he uh, – I know a lot of Ravens fans are going to be all over this saying, oh, we should get Miles Jack. He'll be so nice next to Patrick Queen. And he would. We would have a lot of speed at linebacker. And I was trying not to turn this into a Ravens-Miles Jack video, but you know how it goes, man. So – I wouldn't be mad at it. And, you know, Ravens with the comp pick, so he wouldn't count against the comp pick. Bobby Wagner wouldn't count against the comp pick. So, either way. But, yeah, Miles Jack is out of Jacksonville. Uh, we'll see what his next destination is. Is it going to be with the Ravens? I mean, he got 30 other teams that he could go to, too, uh, and help him out. But they would be getting a good young player. And I think um, for whoever signs him next, because I, I wouldn't see it being a multi-year deal, maybe a two-year deal at the most. Um, but I think it could be like a one-year deal, two years at max, but a one-year deal um, just to be like, all right, let's 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 see what you got. Let's see how you fit in our system because we've been seeing you with the Jaguar system for a little while. But let's see how you fit in our system and if it's worth it to sign you to an extension uh, when that time comes. Now, um, I think just to speak on the Ravens as a little example, um, if he was to sign with the Ravens, just hypothetical. Uh, Patrick Queen right now, he has uh, two years left on his deal. Then he has the possible fifth-year option. So I think if the Ravens were to sign him, they will sign him to either a two- or a three-year deal uh, just so he could match Patrick Queen's last couple of years on his deal. So that would have those two paired together, and then that would allow for the Ravens to make some decisions uh, later on down the road when that time came but that's just a little example anyway appreciate y'all i love y'all and just like miles jack is when it comes to being with the jacksonville jaguars i'm out